The Battle of Green has started. Many countries are creating some of the biggest mega projects from Saudi Arabia to the city of Dubai to the United States. Still, there's one thing in common. Sustainability and going green have become more critical than ever. You see, we humans have made many mistakes in the past. After the Industrial Revolution, we damaged the ozone layer and caused unexplainable damage to the Earth, even accelerating global warming. However, the U.S. is focused on making its new project sustainable, one that won't be criticized heavily and will benefit the general public and humanity. Yet, we haven't heard about any of these three mega projects we're about to discuss. So, here are the three secret renewable energy mega projects the U.S. has been working on. Spoiler alert, the last one will surprise you. Sunzia Wind Project. Starting the list is the Sunzia Wind Project an innovative, effective, and most importantly, sustainable wind farm that could change the city of New Mexico and, potentially, the United States. The Sunsea Wind Project contains a 3.5 gigawatt massive wind farm with a 550 mile high voltage transmission line. According to the developers, this will be the largest clean energy infrastructure project in United States history. Many countries, including Saudi Arabia, are moving away from fossil fuels. That's why we saw the rise of some of the largest cities, like Niam, which will not have any aspect using fossil fuels. Moreover, the world in general is becoming greener and greener and swiftly moving away from fossil fuels. For that sole reason, the Sunzia Wind Mega Project is one of the hallmark examples for the US to follow. Once completed, it could create a cleaner, more sustainable energy future, protecting our environment, lowering global warming, creating more jobs, and producing efficient energy. But this begs the question, why is Sunzia Wind Project so important? Why Sunzia? New Mexico City is one of the most energy hungry cities in the United States. It accounts for two fifths of electricity sales, signifying its overall importance. But that's where Sunzia comes in. This project aims to take New Mexico's already existing wind resources and deliver cleaner electricity to many other regions in the Southwest. And if we go to cities like Texas and others in the Southwest, things are entirely different. With extreme heat waves, new data centers, and increased industrial production, power shortages are common in the region. This happened very recently in 2024, when regulators said the US Southwest and Texas are at risk of shortfalls. To fix the issue, the Sunzia project is one of the US's most important mega projects that will change everything. This project will meet increasing energy demands while eliminating greenhouse gases. But this mega project comes with many problems of its own. Before that, we need to cover the cost and construction because this will surely shock you. Cost and construction. This mega project comes at a hefty price tag that the US government must pay. The construction will cost $11 billion, which is enormous for a wind farm project like Sunzia. However, the developers argue that this mega project's long-term benefit will outweigh the cons. To make things interesting, the Sunzia mega project will create thousands of new jobs and a whole new labor market. Construction started in 2023, and it will be completed by 2026. But what about its construction? This project includes 900 wind turbines in the Estancia Valley. In 2023, Pattern Energy, the owners of this mega project, ordered 674 3.6 megawatt turbines and around 242 Vestas 4.5 megawatt turbines. The Sunzia mega project will have a 550 mile line that will connect the wind farm in central New Mexico to Pinal County in south central Arizona. These transmission lines will contain a total of 3,000 megawatts of electrical power, bringing relief to many regions in Southern America. Legal challenges. But even a mega project this ambitious faced legal challenges building a wind farm like this. In 2023, a case in Arizona Superior Court asked the Sunzia Project's Certificate of Environmental Compatibility for Arizona to be halted. The main issue was that the CEC was changed back in 2015, which didn't fully benefit the state of Arizona on a multi-point AC line. It would help more as a point-to-point, -point, taking the original focus of the project away. But despite the odds, the developers of these mega projects have actively battled, made amendments, and are still on the way to providing one of the US's biggest green mega projects. Champlain Hudson Power Express. Wait until you hear about this next mega project on our list. This one is called the Champlain Hudson Power Express. It is another ambitious energy transmission project currently under construction. Let's just call this mega project Chippy due to its big name. 
This project involves the construction of a 339 mile high voltage direct current cable, which would be mostly embedded underwater along the bed of Lake Chaplin and Hudson River. This project involves the construction of a 339 mile high voltage direct current cable, which would be mostly embedded underwater along the bed of Lake Champlain and the Hudson River. However, the main goal of this project is to transport clean energy from Quebec, Canada to New York City. We're talking about sending massive amounts of energy from one country to another. Why Chippy? The problem with the city of New York is that it heavily depends on fossil fuels. The in-city power plants run on fossil fuel 24 hours a day, and it's not good for the city's environment. This project aims to minimize aging and polluting power plants and replace them with greener lines. The main purpose of this project is to reduce carbon emissions, improve air quality, and take advantage of Quebec's abundant green hydropower resources. Cost and Construction The project was announced in 2010, but is expected to be completed by 2026. The construction has been going on heavily, but the central part of the construction is that the Quebec section of the line would start at the DC conversion station to connect with the Hydro-Quebec Trans Energies Hurdle substation of 635-315 kV near La Prairie, finally reaching the junction point at the international border in Lake Champlain. Initially, the budget was only 400 to 500 Canadian dollars for this project. However, the price has reached a staggering 2.2 billion making it one of the biggest mega projects under construction in the United States. While many commissions have deemed this project unnecessary, and despite the initial reaction, it will prove to be one of the most innovative works of art in the United States. The growth of this project has continued and it will mainly be buried under lakes and riverbeds to minimize visual impact and maximize its pros. Challenges for the project. The biggest challenge of this project is the Sierra Club, which has long opposed this plan. According to them, the Chippy should stop all hope of giving New York locally produced wind power so they can focus on local energy production as an alternative. On top of that, they even went as far as to create a 40-minute video and presentation about the concerns with this project. Despite their efforts, the project is still under construction and is expected to be completed by 2026. Gemini Solar Project However, the most exciting mega project on our list is the Gemini Solar Project. This innovative solar project is just 30 minutes from Las Vegas and is one of the most significant energy storage projects. Sited on less than 5,000 acres of land, this project generates enough reliability to give Nevada its 10% of peak power demands, which is very productive for the state. For reference, the Gemini Solar Project is contributing to a whopping $463 million in economic development for the state, which is quite impressive. Cost and Construction this solar project was so innovative that it took around $1.3 billion in financing and is now on its way to construction. While the project is fully set to be completed in 2025, there are a few phases and some of them are already in the works. If we talk about the construction, the Gemini Solar Project will contain 1.8 million solar panels that can generate up to 690 megawatts of energy, ultimately powering 10% of Nevada's peak power demands. To make it interesting, the solar arrays are then located with around 380 megawatt of four hour battery storage, which will provide Nevadan residents with 1,400 megawatts an hour of clean and reliable energy even after the sun goes down. So far, even the public response to the Gemini solar project has been negative, but when completed, it will be one of the biggest green mega projects in the United States. Conclusion. Yet in the world of construction, not many people know exactly what's happening with these projects. In the race of solar power, we see the U.S. stepping up its game to the next level. These mega projects might not be the biggest, but they are practical enough to provide many areas of the country with clean and sustainable energy. Which mega project were you aware of? Tell us in the comments below. And if you enjoyed the video, please make sure to subscribe to our channel and ring that bell icon to stay up to date with the latest construction news.